Hmm. I've seen you take care of yourself more than any three adults put together. But, uh, thanks for saying that. Now, nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. Maybe one of the others can look at it for you. Oh, shit. Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? We should see what's going on. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Oh, Rebecca's water good. broke. <laughs> mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. Is that supposed to happen? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. What should we do first, Kenny? It's Kenny the Aufgabe given. Kenny, come on, you gotta focus. Right, right, sorry. Clean water for one thing. And blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah? You just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem... I know it must have been hard, but... Thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mac a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking, how do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would have never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Maybe it's between Jane and Bonnie. Entscheid wird auf jeden Fall für Jane. Bonnie ist nun scheiß. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. Maybe I should go with Jane. Better hurry and catch up then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast and let's be careful. interessant gewesen, ob ich auch ins Museum hätte gehen können, weil das Gebäude da vorne... Oh, hey. I knew you'd be here. <lacht> well, yeah, I told you I was coming here. Anyways. Well... It's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. I like the height. Did you find anything out here? Huh? Oh, uh, not yet. I hadn't really started looking until you showed up. I hope this place is what we're looking for. God knows we could use a break. Check this out. This gate's still locked. 
Which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. You might need to bust the mechanism. You think this thing still works? <laughs> Check the muzzle, Napoleon. Oh. They fill them with cement, so they're safe. It's broken. Find anything? No, not even trash. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I think I almost had it. Keep looking. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. Can we fight him? Could be too risky. I didn't get a good look at him. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. We should just try and stay out of sight till he's gone. Good call. Shit. Hide now. Hey. I just want to talk to you. Do you understand me? Yes. I'm Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially... Маленькая девочка. Little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I swear to we you. Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please, 
Is it just you and your sister? No. I have many friends. In the woods. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No! You are not nice people! You have already left me defenseless, and now you... You take my sister's medicine? You are worried. Hey! Baby. We've got people who are suffering. Who need this medicine? <clears throat> Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Oh, look at all of it! Clementine, we need people that stuff! People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special! Clementine, yes, you might... You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Jane, don't do it. Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? We should go get everyone else. Yeah. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place opened. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. Clem! Clem, hey! Any luck with that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from you in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. The deck might be a safe place we can stay tonight, where Rebecca could have the baby. At least, if we can't find something better. I guess that's something. I should check it out. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah. She's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I like her. She's honest, and she knows what she's doing. Yep. That's more than I can say for some. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just... he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. You're wrong. Kenny's stronger than anyone. He tries to protect us. I don't know, Clem. I used to think that, that maybe all the horror hadn't gotten to you yet. But you watched your friend murder Carver. Not just kill him, but... Clem, you didn't even blink. Kenny did go too far. It made me uncomfortable. There's still hope for you then. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you. You're getting yourself all worked up over nothing. There's a room up there that might be good for when Rebecca has the baby. Jane's trying to get it open. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Episode 4, I think, right?